hi guys welcome to my channel so today video is all about this Lumiere hair it's a true sister lace frontal wig and it's in the length 22 this is what the packaging looks like it comes in a purple kit little bag and it also comes in a box that's what the hair looks like it also comes with three no four bending rollers and it also comes with uh, I think it's an headband or handbag it, it has an accessory inside it with my camera wasn't picking up but anyway that's what the hair looks like it has three combs at the front and one comb at the back and it also has an elastic strap as well so i decided to do a little bit of customization with this one because the hair has not been perfect in my opinion but this is what the inside of the wig looks like as you can tell it's a three sister lace frontal wig and it has like six inches you know parting space at the front and also like three inches parting space at the back as well so the hair also comes with baby hair and the parameters of it but i decided to show you guys how i you know pluck the hair because the hair was not be plucked in my opinion so that's just me you know taking out the ss air from the front of the hair just to make it look more natural so i'll show you guys as i go back and forth just to you know let you guys know the difference between the one that i plucked and the one that came straight from the box and Please bear in mind that this plucking, you know, part is not necessary if you're going for a center part or half part. But if you're going to do the half up, half down, or you want to do that uh, rough bunny style, then that's when I think it's necessary in my opinion. But if not, this step, you can definitely skip it if you like. So all I'm just doing is just applying my uh, its protection spray on it because I don't have my bottle water around me. So when I'm done with that, I showed you guys the difference. Look at that. That's the one I did and the one that came straight from the box. So anyway, so moving on, I decided to do the bold cap method. After cutting off the SS, you know, cap on my head, I went ahead and applied the, uh, what's it called, bold hold glue on my, you know, on the areas where I was going to apply the lace of the hair. But in this case, I haven't cut the lace of the, you know, wig. So I decided to just place the lace exactly on the areas that I applied the glue, you know, the edges of the hair exactly on the areas where I was, where I applied the glue. So that's exactly what I did just now. And I combed the all hair, back, hair all back just to, you know, make sure that the hair is secure. And I applied a little bit of heat on the hair just to make sure that the, lace is melt you know properly on my hair and i cut off the excess lace and also i also applied my scarf you know just to make sure that the hair is laying down flat so i cut my lace using the you know section pattern depending on what you want to go for but i prefer cutting the lace in sections so in this case i use my curling wand and you can decide to use whatever you like you can use your tongue you can use anything to curl the hair but for this you know tutorial i use my curling wand to you know create a voluminous curls on the hair so depending on what you you want to go for anyway but I decided to go for this one. I really like the hair so far, so good. I like the hair. I like the fact that the hair looks so natural on me. And I also like the fact that I could style the hair anyhow I like. As you guys can tell already, the hair looks so, so natural on me that you can barely tell that I'm wearing a wig. If Another thing I noticed about this vendor is the fact that the shipping was really, really quick. I mean, very quick because it took about four days to get in the UK. And also, I like the fact that the hair is so, so soft and it's not shedding at all. It felt so lightweight. I don't know. I just keep going on about it. Anyway, those are the things I like about the hair. So, bear in mind that you can, you know, you know, bleach the hair. You can dye the hair. You can do whatever you like to the hair because it's a uh, full human hair so you can treat it as your own natural hair so if you're watching my video for the first time and you're not sure about how to use your curl uh, how to do a proper wand curls i actually curl the hair you know away from my face when i get to this right side i curl it away from my face i wrap the hair around the wand and curl it away from my face and when i got to the other side which was the right side I wrap the one also on I wrap the hair on the one as well and curl it away from my face that way the hair would you know give you that about power look you're going for but if you're the type that actually like full proper you know curls like bang on curls then before you drop the curls of the hair then 
you can use the clip to hold the hair up and that would keep the curls in place for like longer but if you're just in a hurry to you know like curl your hair and you're ready to go you don't have the time to keep uh, applying clip on the hair here and then then this is a definitely most for you like this is the easiest way to go about it just curl it away from your face and you're good to go you don't need to apply any clip if that's you know the look you're going for so i actually applied the got to be a uh, styling oil the oil is very very lightweight so there's no need to worry about the fact that it's gonna wear your hair down as you can see the hair was like purping hi guys welcome to my channel so today's video is all about this linear hair right here the hair is a 360 lace frontal wig and is in the length 22 inches the hair is really really soft to touch and it has still silky feel to it but there are a lot of things that i noticed about the hair that i'm just going to go straight to the point with you guys the first thing i noticed is the fact that the hair was not pre-plugged straight from the box that has an advantages and disadvantages to it the advantage is that you get to plug the hair the way you like you to your own taste but the disadvantage is that if you're a newbie and you don't know how to pluck your hair, then that might be a little bit of eco. If you know how to pluck your hair, then that's not a problem at all. And also, if you don't if you don't know how to pluck your hair, you can also use that as an opportunity to learn how to pluck your hair. In my opinion, that's also a great thing to do. You know, learn how to customize your hair the way you want them. So that's one thing I notice about the hair first. Another thing that I like about the hair is the fact that the hair comes with a baby hair around the perimeter. So if you're the type that like baby hair, then you definitely like the fact that this hair has baby hair around the perimeters, both to front and back of the hair because it's a true sister lace frontal wig. Another thing that I like about the hair is the fact that the hair is really, really soft, very, very soft. So that's the bonus for me because the most important thing that I like about the hair is the fact that the quality of the hair is really, really amazing. Like guys, there has been no shedding or tangling whatsoever. Throughout the styling of this hair, I didn't experience any shedding or tangling. Also, the hair is very, very lightweight, so you don't really feel that you're wearing a wig or anything. So the fact that it's about 130 density even makes it look natural because, you know, it has that natural look to it. But I actually decided to go for a center part today because I'm not the type that wears center part. I feel it doesn't suit me but you guys let me know what you think if center part suits me or not. But this is my first time like in years or ages that I've actually decided to go for center parts uh, in a while. So I just started to use the opportunity to show you guys what the hair looks like on me wearing the center parts, which I really quite like. I also like the fact that the medium cap size is also a good fit for me. You have to stress about cutting too much lace or too much air out of the hair, which is a good thing that I really like about the hair. Another thing that I like about the hair is the fact that the hair took to curls really, really well and it's very, very soft to touch. Look at how bouncy the curls are. This is really, really nice. I like that. So. The most important thing for me so far so good is the quality of the hair and the quality of the hair is really amazing in my opinion. The hair is also true to length in my opinion. The wave pattern of the hair straight from the box is really really amazing so you can decide not to curl the hair if you like which is you know not a big deal if you're the type that you know don't have the time to go for that in case you just want to wear the hair and go so the curl pattern straight from the box is wearable depending on you know the look you're going for another thing i like about the hair is the fact that you can style the hair anyhow you like you can go for ponytail you can do the half up half down style depending on the look you're going for you can style the hair just like your own natural hair you can use the elastic strap to you know to secure the hair at the back if you're going for a ponytail look so i already know most of those styles in my videos so i didn't really want to go back and keep repeating myself so i just started to go for a center part look but bear in mind you can style the hair anyhow you like you know because it's a three sister list from two weeks so that's my thoughts about the hair so far i'll leave the details of the hair in the description box below please feel free to check out the vendor and let me know what you guys think and i'll see you in my next one